From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Emily Luxon with your news update. Family and friends said their final goodbyes to a Rutherford County teenager who had been missing for over two years. Devin Bond's funeral was held at the Fellowship Bible Church in Murfreesboro. He was buried at the Miller Cemetery in Christiana. He went missing back in March of 2017. He was just 16 years old at the time. Earlier this month, detectives reopened the case. They searched an area on Barfield Crescent Road and found his rema remains on November 12th. We're told no foul play was involved in his death. Nashville got a little greener thanks to the 18th annual Reliefing Day. The Nashville Tree Foundation and NES partnered to plant 200 trees across the city. Volunteers planted about 150 shade trees and fruit trees in 12 schools in Northeast Nashville. Nashville Mayor John Cooper also participated. Reliefing Day is held the Saturday before Thanksgiving each year. A Nashville holiday tradition kicked off Saturday. Cheekwood's holiday lights open to the public. One mile of lights illuminate the gardens. There are also live reindeer, a poinsettia tree, and s'mores. The lights will be up until January 5th. And now with a look at your forecast, here's meteorologist Henry Rothenberg. Emily, through the overnight, we got to watch out for some areas of fog, maybe a little drizzle, and hey, towards the plateau, not ruling out a flurry or two will not amount to anything. It may be one of those you have to do a double take and think, oh, maybe that was a snow flurry. Clouds are going to be stubborn for Sunday. They're going to break up, but it's going to be very slow. So we're going to call for a mostly cloudy sky going through the day. Temperatures pretty chilly in the uh, overnight hours. 35, 54 that high for Sunday. Hey, take a look at the seven day rain chances ramping up on the one day we don't need it. That's traveling day Wednesday. We'll keep chances slight for Thanksgiving and then they pick up again next weekend.